Hey, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to Shelly P Gaming. As you can see here, this is FIFA 23. No mods, no nothing on next gen. Just wanted to show you how it looks from here. As you can see, you can do this offline or online with the new FIFA World Cup D DLC. I just want to show you the best glitch in my life as a Chelsea fan or as a Thomas Tuchel fan. So you just go on, load your World Cup mode, go off, you quit the World Cup mode, you don't do anything else, go straight into new, new career. As you can see from the last screen, Graham Potter was a new Chelsea coach. And look at this, the Thomas Tuchel, Steven Gerrard, the old coaches from FIFA release, or even Thomas Tuchel, I don't even know how he's on ya. Graham Potter, just to show you, is at Brighton. Bruno Lage. So you can use Thomas Tuchel for any club. You can create a club. It can be Chelsea, which is what I'm going to do. It's going to be my next career mode on this channel with Thomas Tuchel coming back to the bridge. Potter, get out, mate. Your invisible cloak is, is, is over, Harry Potter. Anyway, let me just show you. It works. It absolutely works. Don't ask me how I found this. I went on one day and, yeah, you can change team or create a club here and Thomas Tuchel can be your manager, which get, if you were to see my heart rate when I found this out, oh, my word. I was so excited, so happy, so stoked because as a Chelsea fan, I don't know with this Potter. The players look distraught. They look like they have no idea what they're doing. And yeah, the, he's probably going to be let go because Todd Bowley and the Chelsea board say they want results or they like data data driven. And our last month, I'll, I don't even know if we're on a data graph it would just be like this, me boop boop, when we beat Salzburg. So I'm not happy as a Chelsea fan. And if you agree with me, then bring Thomas Tuchel back. Has it ever been done before in such a short space of time? No, I don't know. I can't remember. Not in my lifetime or not at a club that I've been following. Um, but yes, I, 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 yeah, I'm speechless. <laughs> and I'm over the moon that I can do this. Let's have a look. Oh, there's only one catch. There's only one catch. The squads are backdated. So, like, for example, Aubameyang is not a Chelsea. And Thomas Tuchel's last favourite signing. Because um, he wanted to dominate the world with him again, like at Borussia Dortmund. Um, but, yeah, anyway, so you just have to update your squads manually a bit. Like, um, bring Aubameyang in. So that's why you give yourself a little bit extra money, um, depending where you're going. Uh, you can see Marcus Alonso is still here. And, if I'm not mistaken, Christensen... At least Kurabali's here, Lukaku's on, lay, on loan. So let me show you Thomas Tuchel. Let's go into contract negotiation just to, to show you all how it really works. And look at the graphics, there he is, big TT, Mr. T. The guy who absolutely loved us. We, he loved us through a divorce, his family got split. And then we come along with a new project and we just kick him in his ass off to India. No, man. Absolute BS, if you ask me. Bring him back. Show him how sorry you are and you made a mistake. Because that's what I'm going to do. And I want to show the world how good this is. And, and Thomas Tuchel is back in London. And you can dominate the world again. When the, like, we did it way too soon. I know a project, and we're we giving Potter a project. Um, but... We, we, we should have given Tuchel a project. We started a project. We bought Cucurella for an over 60 million pounds. We, we, Tuchel bought Kudumbali. Tuchel should have got Ronaldo. But Tuchel went out and won an Aubameyang. He's proven to be good under him. So how is that not a project also, Todd Bowley? Oh, flipping, just shoot like, you, like you're in America with, with no gun license or whatever, like always, man. But like I'm saying, yeah, so you got to update, you got to buy your players manually. Aubameyang straight in from Barcelona. And it, it's not too outdated, it's not too far. I mean, Michi Bestwai and Alonso and Callum hudson Adoy is still here. Midfielders, we didn't really let any go. Billy Gilmore is still here. So as a Chelsea fan, you got a lot of uh, transfers to do. But we'll just bring Aubameyang in. Cucurella, going back to Barca, you're mad, man. 
And the graphics on this Thomas Tuchel scan, because I'm sure it was a scan. Look at it. I'm in love. Thomas Tuchel will pay anything to work with Aubameyang. And this is it. We're going to pay everything. Three years. Doesn't matter. Looks like he's on his way out already, but he's actually playing well for us. There he is. Aubameyang and Thomas Tuchel reunite again. I really hope this... Yo, I really hope I make somebody's day. Just one person. You can leave a like. <laughs> if, if you're going to do this, leave a like and let me know. Oh, actually, let me know what team you're going to do it in. Also, if you're not a Chelsea fan and you just want too sure. Like, there's another surprise in the second half of this video, which I might do as well, or which could, which I highly suggest they do in real life. But let's just watch Tuchel sure and Aubameyang reunite. And tell me, with this lineup, with Sterling, Aubameyang, Kai Havertz on the right wing, Mason Mount, Kovacic and Kante, because Tuchel loves K Kante, James and Chilwell back with those three, or even like um, Kurubali and Silva and Kukurela swapping around, but maybe he would have played Chalaba or brought in another centre back, because um, Aspeliqueta is getting on in age, but look at this lineup. Tell me we wouldn't have done well in the next year. I mean, we, we, had, we had it all. We honestly had it all. Look at that. With Bendy and, and Kepa. So yes, let me know your lineups. Let me know who, whose club you're going to go save with Tuchel and his formations and his, his, his face. I wouldn't say new face, but yeah, if you're going to do a Chelsea one, let me know because I'm going to. And hopefully it comes out on this channel after the RB Leipzig, depending how long that one takes. And go out and check out the RB Leipzig career mode. We're absolutely creaming the Bundesliga. But I just wanted to show you that Thomas Tuchel is not only um, just, just in it for the Chelsea, um, just to show you that it does work on other options. So just don't forget, always, switch your PlayStation on, load the World Cup mode, because I don't know what it does. It, it kicks it out into the first database, or it, maybe it just shows you how long this was actually on. And I tested it online, so you get your, your youth, youth academy graduate, your star also. Onto the World Cup DLC mod, you can start online, offline. I thought it was offline initially, and look, there it is. You can put Stevie G at Liverpool, you can put Stevie G at Wolves, you can put Bruno Lage, Graham Potter, you can play at Brighton and let him stay there instead of coming here. Not too many change besides those ones, but I mean... Even Bruno Lage, you can take him somewhere in the Bundesliga or and steal some Wolves players. Go to Spain. Steven Gerrard, you can put him at Wolves. I know they got Lopetegui now, or forgive my pronunciation, but this is what we're going to do. We are going to bring the old lady back to the number one old lady. <laughs> and Tommy Tuchel, Mr. Thomas Tuchel, will win the European UEFA Champions League with Juventus. With those three at the back, two wing backs, they've already got a good foundation. You can bring in German players, you can bring in players from Chelsea, steal them along with them. And the Mendes, the Kovacic is looking for a fresh start, the players that bonded with them. You can even take them back to Borussia Dortmund. Make a Bundesliga project and win the, the Bundesliga and dominate and overthrow Bayern Munich. I mean, there are just so many storylines. And FIFA 23 EA, I wish you would leave like the managers and the players who had faces or like, like this, Thomas Tuchel was in the database, clearly. Just leave them as free agents. 
Like, we pay so much, why can't you just leave them there? And you, you flip and you got your anti-cheat on and, 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 and kids, players, hackers, they still get on. But I'm so happy about this. And FIFA 23 for me is actually a very good game. And yeah, I'm just so happy. So everybody, don't forget to like and subscribe. Go, please go over and watch the RB Leipzig career mode. We've got a new number 10. Timo Werner's been out injured. He's back. We're absolutely creaming it in the Bundesliga. We're first place. Have a look at the points. We've brought in big stars. We've officially just sold one of our first team big stars to Barcelona. And what, uh, while we're talking, what does everybody think about uh, our show speeds? World Cup. World Cup song. I love it. I love the pronunciations and everything. That kid is, is, is so famous. Don't forget to like and subscribe, everybody. Like this video, comment what you're going to do with Tommy Tuchel, and let me know. Keep safe, everybody.